Hello, my hearties. A very good morning to you. It's just me, Scotty McClure, and a very, very warm welcome to our morning pop-up. The time has just gone uh, 20 past 8. I think we're at 8.22 on Wednesday morning, Wednesday the 6th of April. How's that? That's absolutely amazing, and it's lovely to have you with us. Now, we're live on the big one. We're on the TikTok, of course. Good morning. I returned to Glasgow today, says Karim. Ah, Karim, I loved all your pictures, and I wondered if you'd got to the wee ruined chapel at Ruffy Murkus. Fantastic. And uh, you were able to report back on that. That would just be amazing. But obviously, don't go to any bother. There's the wonderful Martin. Says, good morning, Lala. There's Uncle Rod. Now, Rod was uh, Rod hard to stay. He won't mind me saying. Says morning, and I say morning to him. And Rod hard to stay was, and I hope the others can cover their ears, but perhaps the finest wizard of the big switchboard you could ever ask for. So there you are, and he's with us. Good morning, Rod. Lovely to have you with us, and a big dinky do to you. And thank you for all the wonderful work that you did over so many years for so many of us. So there you are, that's you. Uh, yes, Scotty, uh, uh, and passes it, I had Cullen Skink as well. Oh, Karim, you would enjoy the Cullen Skink. What a great soup that is. Am I right in thinking it's smoked haddock soup? Ha, oh, Cullen Skink, I can taste it, it's lovely. Good morning, Scotty, have a lovely day. Eden, good morning to you, my dear friend, my, my, my tuba. My B-flat tuba man, is that right? Have I got that right, Aidan? Have I got the right, Aidan? Are you fasting, sir? Uh, well, needing to fast, I would say. You're on early today. A very good morning to you, Gordon Robertson. Yes, indeed, and you're up and about, of course, as always. Uh, so dinky-doo, fantastic. Rod sent me a lovely big smile. Isn't that nice? A top man is our Rod. Dinky-doo, dinky-doo, how are we? Um, he had the unenviable task of answering the phones for Scotty McClue's nightline. Oh, there we have it. Uh, yes, B-flat tube on the big one. Absolutely, Aidan. And I would love to hear you give me the Hall of the Mountain King on it. Yes, am I right? Am I right, Aidan? Or am I right with that one? Dinky do, fantastic. Lovely to have you with us. Uh, now then, are you going to open the phones, buddy? Well, Martin, I don't see any reason as to why we shouldn't actually open the phones. So there we are. So I think what we'll do, uh, there's Big Daddy says, Del boy. Thank you, Big Daddy. That is a great compliment. Uh, I would have uh, enjoyed being Del boy. I'm absolutely sure. Yes, Martin, what we'll do is hang around for a few minutes. Uh, so there we are. Now, Wormy, you need to not be silly. This is not a place for trolls. And anybody who's silly goes straight down the swanee. So there you are. So just steady on, Wormy. I don't want to lose you. So soon after you've just joined us, I know you're probably used to trolling, but there's a rule on the internet that you never, ever, 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 ever troll Scotty McClure. And that's just what we don't do. We don't troll Scotty. Uh, wonderful. Uh, hi, Scotty and all. VJ, how lovely to have you with us. And a big dinky do to you. Fantastic stuff. Um, I have the full support of the people. Robster, Bobster, of course you do. I conduct mainly these days. Oh, Aiden, how fantastic. I had the privilege of meeting the great Richard Evans. Wonderful, wonderful man. And I told him I was a huge fan of his work. And he told me he was a fan of mine. Ah, so there were a fair exchange, I tell you. Uh, but, uh, but that was him at the um, Guild Hall in Preston uh, in his days with the BNFL. You know, in the days when... Virtually every band played Slade Bun. <laughs> we love it. Wonderful stuff. And of course, as you know, Brass Band is a huge love of mine. So there we are, a well-balanced Brass Band coming out with some of the, uh, the old favorites. I can remember a gentleman playing at a supermarket. He was conducting the local school. And he said, uh, right, we'll do number 32, Christians Awake. 
So they started off and it was, he said, stop. We won't do that one again because you don't know notes. <laughs> oh, that little stuff. But nevertheless, these people are tremendous. I'm sorry to hear that, Aidan. If you're ever talking to him, please see a massive dinky-doo from Scotty McClure. Great man. This would be probably getting on for 30 years ago. Wonderful. The BNFL band. And, of course, the big ones, Black Knight Mills, Fairy Engineering. Uh, you know, just, just superb. Uh, do you play any instruments, Mr. McClure? I, I, I have a dabble on the piano and uh, a dabble on the squeeze box. So there we have it. Dinky do. Uh, fantastic. Hi, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for joining us this morning. Stick with us. You're watching Scotty McClure. Tick tock, stop, talk show. Never scroll and never troll. There we are. Follow us as soon as you can. Uh, yes, you're at the conducting. And uh, uh, did I not hear somewhere that you were conducting uh, the wonderful Tewksbury? Have I got that right, Aidan? There we are. But do correct me if I get anything wrong. There we are. And of course, a B flat tuba man. You'll know the lot. It's wonderful. Hello, good morning, Scotty from Sunny Pitlochry. Hi, B. Dave. Are you just about to open the shop? I think I'll come down for a pound of beef sausages. A pound of mince and two wee fillet steaks. There we are. And I think I'll also take some dripping if you've got it. Uh, tremendous. Morning from Inverness. You're right. Hayden, we love you from Inverness. Snakey, from Snakey like your eyes. That's your say your eyes up there. There we are. Cameron Dickinu, thank you for following. Yes, qualified for the national finals last Saturday. Hayden, that's tremendous. Uh, very recently, I watched again the brilliant Brast Off, the movie. Ah, I can't stop a wee tear, Aidan. I'm sorry, but there you are. Right, now, Mr. McLaren, I think we'll just send you straight down the swanee. You're on the wrong live. We never, ever, ever, ever troll Scotty McClue. But you've described yourself well, I have to say. A very good description. Describe yourself in one word, Mr. McLaren. Morning, Scotty, in the rain in South Wales. Yes, but it'll never dampen the enthusiasm of the choirs in the valley, I say to you. Morning, Scotty, says the wonderful Susan. Dinky do Susan first. And a very good morning to you. Susan's been with us for a, a, a very long time. A, a lovely lady. Uh, replying to Rod, Copple Subscription Band are doing well since I left. Rod, would you stop that? You are a wonderful player. I think, were you not E-flat coronet? Have I got that right? Uh, there we are. Oh, no. Were you tenor horn? Was that right? Were you tenor horn? There we are. I think Rod was tenor horn. Uh, fantastic stuff. Good morning. Morning, Susan. I hope you are well. Uh, morning, Scotty Dinky Doo. Howdy from across the pond here in the United States. We love it. There we are. Now, here's good morning. It's Brian from Whitney in Oxon, Oxfordshire. There we are. We love it. We love Whitney, Hartley Wintney, uh, Didcot, uh, Blueborough, <laughs> Aston Tyrold. Uh, whereas Wantage, I used to drink in the Blue Boar in Wantage, tremendous, and the Barley Moor at Blueberry. Uh, howdy from across the pond here in the States and the Red Line. Uh, can you say hi to Alfie? For my friend, I can, it's charge. Uh, who have we got here? Sheffield. Ah, Jessica. My love for Sheffield will never, ever, ever dwindle. I just adored it. What a wonderful show we had on Hallam FM Radio. Those were the days, my friend. I can tell you. Uh, wonderful. Now, who else have we got here? Lots and lots of you joining us. Please follow me as soon as you come on, guys. All right. So as soon as you join us on the TikTok, follow us. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Now, I've uploaded a load of new videos. If you're a TikToker, you need to watch, like, and share every single one. Because uh, we've uploaded the two pheasants yesterday. 
and we've got Stanley the pheasant who visits the, the garden, and we've got uh, Megan, his missus, was looking for him. So we've uploaded these guys. Get a look at these. Good morning from Fleetwood. I love Fleetwood. I can remember, was it your rugby team had done very, very well when I went to Red Rose about 30 years ago. And I was there on a Saturday night, a summer Saturday night, or a spring Saturday night, and they got a lap of honour round the town on the open top bus, and then Scotty McClure went and had a fish supper. We call it a fish supper in Scotland, a fish tea, a uh, uh, fish and chips, I had fish and chips in Fleetwood, and boy, did I enjoy every morsel. It was just amazing. There, yes, tenor horn, says Rod. There you are, you see. I'm not just an athlete, Rod. I'm also a black belt in karaoke. There we are, so never a dull minute. I'm also very big in origami. I used to be known as the real tear. Uh, fantastic. Now, uh, encourage us, love, it says. Encourage your viewers to share your life and invite more friends. How do you invite more friends on here? How do we do all these things? You see, I'm... I'm a mere novice when it comes to social media. So you'll have to just live with it, guys. Yes, I'm sure your fish was good. Oh, cat, the fish was outstanding. Uh, you know, really outstanding. I tend not to spoil a fish tea with vinegar. Uh, if you're in Edinburgh, you can have a little brown sauce, but just a little bit of salt, very nice. Uh, there we are. Good Scotty, thank you, says the lovely Susan. We are delighted to hear this, my darling. Thank you very much. Uh, farewell, says Robster Bobster. Farewell, Robster Bobster. Take great care of your dear self. And ta-ra the now. There we are. Ta-ta-la. Onward, absolutely, Robster Bobster. There we are, been with us for a long time. Do come and join us. Can everybody start sharing? Uh, because uh, I hope you're well too. Yes, I'm not too bad, Susan. There we are. Had one or two wee challenges, but we're not too bad. Hey, good day, mate, says said Sydney from down under. Said Sydney, good day. Lovely to have you with us. And you're saying good day, but I bet it's also good evening as well in Australia. Uh, Tura, 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 la, Robster, Bobster's away. He's gone. But uh, no doubt somebody will come and join us. That's what it's all about, I say. And uh, I hope you can find us on the YouTube. I hope you've subscribed. I hope you can find us on Twitch. Now, guys, this is important. I've just started on Twitch. Well, no, I've, I've had an account now for maybe a couple of years, but I haven't really used it. And we've just started live now. I've got 96 followers. That needs to go shooting up to maybe 960,000. Uh, but I'm uh, having to work out how to do that. And it's Scotty underscore McClure. But if I have two or three of you watching, that would be a big help. The Nobel Scott said, Sydney, yes, I thought I should get the Nobel Peace Prize for uh, stopping a, a fight in an empty house. Follow us, guys, as soon as you can. Isn't Twitch for gamers? Well, said Sydney, uh, yes, I mean, I'm, I'm big game. I don't game, and I'm not a gamer, but I thought we'd have a Twitch account. You see, if a platform comes up. I think McClue should have a presence. So there we are. So we might we might start gaming with you all. Lots of bands people used to listen to your Century 105 show after rehearsals. It was a great show, says Aiden. Oh, Aiden, bless you. I loved my bands, people. There we are, just adored it. And I can remember the May Day rally in Barnsley in, what was the park again? And I met the great Tony Benn. Oh, wow, was that a pleasure. Uh, what a lovely, lovely man. And uh, I met Tony Benn and uh, had a good crack with everybody. And, of course, all the bands turned out. And it was just beautiful. I've got so many CDs. I would love to do a brass band program on a radio station and just play the lot uh, who else did I have? You've got to give me a few bands. Fairy Engineering, Hammond's Sauce Band. Remember these, BNFL, 
Um, what else did we have? Fairy engineering, the fairy swordfish. Yes, all, all the collieries. The collieries. Yes, Grimethorpe, of course. Grimethorpe Colliery Band. Yes, one, another of my favourites. Black Dyke Mills. Uh, another of my favourites. There we are. My, my grandfather's clock. Now, who was the wonderful man that played? Was it a tuba solo? In my grandfather's clock. Oh. Uh, you've got your Scottish water. Of course I have. Off to what now? Take care, Susan. Take care of your dear self. Bless you, darling. There we are. Have a lovely day at work and enjoy being you because it's a great thing to be. Uh, there we are. Fantastic. Where would we be without challenges? Oh, where would we be indeed? Where are we now? Where are we going? Uh, you've got your Scottish water. Martin, I have. I have it here. See, there's my Scottish water. Mmm, lovely. We might open up the phone lines, guys, and have a bit of chat. Boxers or briefs? Both said, Sydney, yes. You can put one on over the top of the other. Ah, yes, the euphonium solo John Clough, Aidan. That'll be it. Wonderful stuff. A dark-haired gentleman. And very good. I thought, that's some playing. There we go. We love it. Now, what else have we got here? And I like a lot of the old hymns. You know, the nearer my God to the... The... Um, the, 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 um, oh, any of them, Immortal, Invisible, the Isaac Watts is set to brass band, Abide With Me. Don't you forget about me, Sedge Sidney. How could anyone ever forget about you? Because you are the tops. Uh, where's the squeeze box, Scotty? I've got it here, I've got it. Simple Minds. Oh, what a group they were. I knew the manager of Simple Minds. I worked with them. Deep harmony, oh, Aidan, please, please stop. So wonderful. There we are. That should be your closing theme. Deep harmony, or oh, nearer my God to thee. So there we are. And that's, uh, uh, that will be great, buddy. Yes, Martin, we'll open the phones. I think we should. Fantastic. Uh, now, it would be so wonderful Yes, it'd be wonderful to do a brass band program. I remember having the privilege of presenting the Clyde Cayley on Radio Clyde. That was another of my great things. You see, I've been very, very privileged and very, very fortunate in the media because I've done all the things I set out to do. And it's what do we do next? Don't you forget about me. Uh, oh, simple, oh, don't you forget about me by Simple Minds should be the closing theme. Sorry, said Sydney from Down Under. I just wasn't sure there. Uh, now, who else have we got joining us? Guys, as soon as you join us, follow me, please. Very, very important. Right. Let's open the phones and have a wee chat. See if Martin's about. Right. The phones should be open now. So if you like to give me a ring, then we'll see what's what. Can we have a short song of the squeeze box? I need to get the squeeze box. I forgot it. How could we forget about you? I oh, said Sydney. Absolutely. From down under. There we are. And from where again, Sid? You'll need to tell us. There we are. Who's this? Is this Martin? Hang on a second, Martin Lyon. We need to turn you up. That's the big problem. So just hang on there. And we'll get to you. There we are. Because we have to turn this down. Hello, Martin. Good. Good morning, Scott, my lad. How are you? How are you doing, Lala? Sorry about that. We have to remember to turn you up. Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> and we've turned you up now. We can all hear you. You're going out yes. right across the world, Martin. Yes. What's that video you uploaded for the, um, the football hooligans? What, um, what, um, what um, was that about? And uh, the football hooligans, that's you and I talking about football hooligans. How they should what? get a, a life sentence. I know, I know. Yeah, and that I would know. stop the nonsense very quickly. They go, stop, stop fighting, we'll get the jail. 
I know, I know. <laughs> you know, and you and that would stop them right away. You say, right there, you are. They say, "What's he in for? Twelve years for fighting yeah. at a football match, yeah, <laughs> and banned from football for life." Uh -huh. And that would settle these people down because I think they go to cause trouble. You know. Yes. This, so, so, um, um, how's the weather? Are you be good or something? Not oh, too bad at all. It's been pretty cold and pretty windy after the kind of tropical weather of last week. Uh huh. You know, and I find that a bit much. But uh, not to worry. The weather's yes. the weather, Martin. The the weather seems dry, but last night there's been a lot of rain last night, so it's it's it's, um, it's beginning to it's supposed to be a lot of snow coming in. Then Easter time's supposed to be um, hot, another and another heat wave again. So all that it's wonderful. Now wait, here's jumbo sausage, Martin. Hang on. Hi, Scotty. Enjoy your morning. I have an exam today. Jumbo sausage. You will be outstanding in that exam, and you will come out with an A plus. There you are. Uh, have you ever done a romantic kiss on a film set? Yes, just the one I delivered and smack her on the lips. Uh, there we are. Uh, but they only get in trouble because they drink. Well, said Sydney, they'll soon learn not to drink with 12 years without alcohol. There you are. Fantastic. So they'll not be getting in trouble inside the slammer. Scotty, what do you feel about everything happening in the Ukraine? I was thinking of going to help. Raptor. I'm never too sure everybody's being pushed into this at the moment, but I need to see exactly what's going on because there's propaganda wars going on on both sides. Yes, there, there we are, Martin. Sorry about that. I was just uh, a wee chit-chat. Have, have you ever been to Adam before? To Adam? Aaron. Oh, to Aaron. Oh, yes. Yes. I stayed the night in Whiting Bay. Uh -huh. And I loved it, Martin. It's, there's a great sense of peace on Aaron. Uh -huh. And I knew a man, a great man called Jimmy Curry. And the yeah. Curry family had a farm on Aaron, Dramadun. And, uh -huh. uh, and Jimmy was the minister of St. James's Church in Pollock in Glasgow. And then he went to Dunlop in Ayrshire, not far from you. Uh -huh. And he was a wonderful man. He was a great friend of the family. He was a great uh, minister of the church. And he was a great um, raconteur and preacher. Uh -huh. The Reverend James Curry. I stay not far from the pier. Oh, I draw some so not actually far from there. So, so do you sometimes take uh, a wee yeah. trip to Aaron? Yes, me and me and Emma's going to take a trip over there when the better weather comes in and stuff. Lovely, so. and you'll be taking the ferry to Brodick. Yes. Yes, and uh, and then you could uh, maybe get a wee bus trip to Loch Ranza. Yes, and um, the boats you you need to go to Aaron from Dawson because this. By the end of this year, there's a lot of work getting done at Jawson Pier. Ah. Means the boats are going to be transferred to Trun. Means the only way to get a ferry is you need to go to Trun. To ah, to right. Have to head off to Trun for the ferry, I see. Martin, yeah. that's great uh, information to have. Thank you for that. What I was going to say to you, how long does the boat take again? It was quite a wee while. Um, the boat takes about an hour. An hour. An hour. An hour. Yeah. That's that's not bad, I'll tell you that, Martin. Listen. And it's um it's um seven pound return, I think. Oh that's uh, not bad. Obviously if you took a car it would be a small fortune, but seven pounds return's great. I know. But that's how much it was um there, but um there's a lot I wanna do this year. I wanna go up to Edinburgh um, again. I wanna do I wanna go to Sky sometime. I wanna go to Fort William and all that. You're a great man, Martin. You're a great man, yeah. you and Emma, yes, do you, great people. Do you still watch Emma as much or have you back uh, off from that? Well, now? I haven't seen it for a while. Um, yeah. so there you are. I've just been very, very busy. I get maxed, you see, and I have to squeeze in some time to do the lives. Ah, uh -huh. you know. So how are you? 
So how are you finding the lives like every day? You finding them a bit better? Mind them, mind them last thing you, you did all that too much and you had a scare. I did. I, I bummed. I bummed myself out by doing every oh, night. Yeah. I think I'm no. not sure everybody wants to see me every night, but uh, it's nice to pop up random and just have a chat. Yes. Like yes, this, what we're doing right now is just—it's a class act, isn't it? Yes. You and I, you and I, having a good old chat in front of the rest of the world. Uh huh. And I'm still watching Take the High Road, but the guy who's uploading them is basically killed in a bit. So I'm still waiting. He is not. He he he's not uploaded for the past ten days. Right. Um, Neighbours is supposed to be axed by June. Uh, oh no! I'm sorry to hear oh, that. Oh, I used yes, to enjoy Neighbours. Uh -huh. The last episode of Hobo City was broadcast on the 29th of oh. um, this month. The last episode was fantastic towards the very end, but the guy that I like, mm. um, Smithy from The Bill, he's moving back into Castry again. Oh, wow. He's going to be moving back into um, um, Fletch. Right. Not Fletch. Uh -huh. Yes. Well, I'll need oh. to get myself a wee job on the soap operas then. Yeah, you should. I think you're going to be a great part in um, casualty or that, whatever. <laughs> yes, that's right, that's right. Sitting up in bed in the hobby. I, w I Would I not make a good consultant? Yes, 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 you will. You know, mm. uh, and, and I could I could say things like, um, Moss, could you get me another five milligrams of this till I see how this patient reacts? <laughs> how about that? Martin, love you lots. I'm going to have to dash, but you take great care. You too, Lala. Love you a lot. Thank you. Love you lots, Lala. Thank you too. You'd better. See you, Lala. I will. Thank you. Top man. There we are. That's our Martin. There we are. A wee quick call there. I think that's excellent. We opened the phone lines just to get a wee bit of a blether. I don't know if Kirsty's watching, but she was well chuffed you left an emoji of her picture in her new glasses. I thought she suited these new glasses tremendously well. There we are. Now, who have we got here? Morning from the UK, Scouse. Lovely to have you from the UK, Scouse. Uh, so there we are. Dinky do. It's me. I haven't been here for a while, big Scotty boy. Another day, another dollar, Dinky do, Scotty. Au revoir, and Dinky do says Noah. It's 12.45 a.m. here. For goodness sake. Red dinky do says Steve Payne. Dinky do Steve. Uh, yes, I'm a reservations as well about it, says Raptor. Yes, Raptor, we need to find out exactly what's going on before we sort of uh, rush headlong into it. Uh, did you sort your wish list, Scotty? I want to buy you a new hat. A wee scooter. You're a lovely, lovely guy. Uh, I haven't sorted my wish list. I need to work out how you do it. Um, I don't know how it how it works. In fact, I can see it in front of me. It says I've got 14 wishes out of 50. Let's see what we do. Which I don't know how you want this. Uh, there we are. That's fine. So that's it. Yes, I think we've got that bit. So it says there's no gifters yet. Ah, yes, yes, I've had wishing bottles and some love chat. I can't, it doesn't seem to be reacting. When I press it, though, that's that's the thing. So I press the wish list, up it comes. It says I can edit it. So there we have it. Fantastic. So what do we do? There we are. We can do that. And we can do that. And... A wishing bottle. There we are. It's coming up. Select a gift. Ah, I see. So we'll have TikToks and we'll have lollipops and we'll have, uh, what have we got? Roses and we'll have uh, a little crown for the king, the king of talk. <laughs> and we'll have hearts. And we'll have a finger heart. So there we are. Right. Uh, set a goal. Uh, and it's a hundred of everything. Is that right? And we'll press confirm and we'll press save. Guys, I think I've just managed to edit the wish list. Have a look at it and tell me what it says. That would be just amazing. There we are, we scooter. 
Have a look at that. Doon the water to Aaron. Oh, Donny boy. We love Aaron, do we not? I just became a top viewer. Donald Weller, thank you for sending me a microphone. Grand old chats or oh, Donny boy, absolutely. Thank you, Harry Billions, for following. Can every human being follow me? If you're watching on Facebook, on TikTok, on Twitch, on YouTube, then subscribe to the YouTube. Follow me on Twitch. Uh, so there we are. You could be in the next Wentworth. Ah, VJ, I need to find out more about Wentworth. Tell me a little bit about that. Scotty, that picture of you as a young man, you're a dead ringer. So there we are, Big Hendo. I thank you. I don't know who that is. Thank you, do, Scotty. Will Scotland win the World Cup? Well, there's every possibility, of course. What never say never. And uh, so there you have it. But I can't uh, predict that. National insurance up today. Jolly good. Donny boy, I think the trick is just to squeeze us till our pips squeak and the rich have got all of our money. Sending love from Utah. Ah, Salt Lake. We love it. Good for you. Uh, you don't follow back. If I followed you for ages and didn't accept me. No, I don't follow back simply because it annoys everybody. How come you followed him and not me? You see, that's the difference. So there we are. Scotty, I'm recovering from COVID cares. Tremendous stuff. But if you follow Scotty, I mean, obviously you get the benefits of uh, being able to set your notifications. So there we have it. Recovering from COVID, thank you very much for joining us. JVB, spread the word, tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. That Scotty McClue is live just for you. Sing dinky do and a very good morning. Uh, Wentworth's based on the old prisoner cell block H. First season 2014 of oh, VJ. Are you thinking, are you wanting McClue to be the prison governor? <laughs> there we are. Cheers. Oh, there's an old Irish blessing. May the road rise to meet you. May the wind be always at your back. The sunshine warm upon your face and the rain falls soft upon your fields. And until we meet again, may God hold you in the hollow of his hand. Isn't that beautiful? An old Irish blessing. I'm just having a cup of tea. Very nice. Uh, there we are. Can we kick Russia out of the Ukraine? Can we dinky do them out? I don't know, Donny boy. We need to find out why they did that in the first place. We need to speak to Mr. Putin. And we can't have him going, oh, I don't, I don't speak to him and all that sort of stuff. He actually has to come out and say his piece. And they have to broadcast it right across the world as an actual piece. We need to watch the old propaganda, you see. There we are. And uh, so we'll see what's happening. And I don't want the people of Russia demonized because of what their leader has been up to. Because Russian people are very beautiful people in the same way that all people are very beautiful people. Donald Weller, you top, top lovely person, has sent me a treasure box times 20. Woo! This is I'm for the first time ever, guys. I've managed to edit my wish list. And you've got to tell me what it looks like. Governor is exactly what I was thinking. I think, VJ, yes, I should be the governor of the slammer. And say, and do you think you are ready for release? So if I were to trust you, would you betray my trust? Well, come on. Speak up. Think very carefully. And there we are. Oh, I don't know. I remember talking to a prison governor and I was saying that I got a lot of letters from prisoners proclaiming their in innocence. He said, oh, yes, 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 I, I've got 500 innocent people in at the moment. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, three meals a day and a roof under your feet. Uh, there was an opinion poll in Russia and 85% support Putin. There we are. So there we are. Well, Donnie, yes, of course you would if the propaganda's right. 
I mean, for goodness sake, look at the people that support our leaders. You know, heavens above, and look at the damage they've done. Uh, just, uh, it's just crazy, you know what I mean? Uh, there we are, dinky do la la. I think leaders throughout the world are kind of much of a muchness these days, you know what I mean? They all seem to be reading from the same script, singing from the same sheet, that sort of stuff. Um, just thought you could be a prison psychiatrist and a support worker or something. Well, remember I uh, once suffered under a very, very, very bad man in a business deal, the only bad man I've ever met. And he would actually, uh, you know, I would, I would have gleaned quite a lot of experience about psychopathy, you see? So that would be rather good. And uh, narcissistic personality disorder, all these things. So it could, uh, that's, that could be very interesting, VG. So you could say I've done a bit of background research by having, uh, you know, run into one bad man. Dinky do la la, beachy, beachy. How lovely to have you with us and a very, very good morning to you. Always a privilege, never a chore. Uh, I started quite early this morning, guys. I started it about 20 past eight. I think it was actually 8.22 when we got on air because I don't know what your experience of uh, social media is, but you tend to sort of have to do wee adjustments sometimes before you, you actually go on. So there are VJ, lovely to have you with us. And dinky do, I say. Dinky do, la la. There we are. Donald, thank you for my treasure box. Another one. Donald, you will bankrupt yourself. I have to say everybody has been very, very kind and very, very generous. They either send me gifts on TikTok or on YouTube. They tap the dollar sign at the bottom left and send me pennies. There we are. It's just incredible. The, 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 the generosity of you is lovely. I am raising money for advertising for the show. And uh, if you're feeling flush, and it's a big ask in this day and age, but if you're feeling flush, there is a GoFundMe account, gofundme.com forward slash Scotty hyphen McClue, if anybody's got a spare fiver. Uh, there we are. Are you making bank from social media now, Scotty? No, big hindo. That's not what it's about. I pop up because I'm a great believer that the world deserves better than what they're getting on mainstream media. You look at your television and you scroll through every channel and tell me if you find ones that you absolutely love and adore. You get a hold of your radio set and tune through all the stations and tell me if you chance upon one that you love and adore. And I would almost guarantee the chances are 99% that you'll settle for second best. There we are. I never, ever do. Uh, so there we have it. Scotty, Sonny Ayrshire, DJ Jason. How lovely to have you with us and a big dinky do to you. I like the lives. The level of interaction's great. Well, Big Hindo, this is proper talk. This is proper talk radio. This is proper talk television. <clears throat> I can actually tell you that any talk shows on television or radio, they're not proper talk shows because they're talking at their so-called audience or their non-existent audience. On here, we have a huge audience and we talk with everybody and we talk to everybody. You see? Uh, so it's, it's, it's not all about Scotty McClure. It's about you. That's why I'm here. And then we can interact and chit-chat. No BS, Scotty. There's no BS, DJ. That's what it's all about. Dinky diddly do. Uh, Lane, we just do dinky do. We don't mess with the uh, we don't mess with the porcelain. We don't mess with the of the quality. Uh, I take a bit of all the mainstream information and what I can get from other sources, big Hindu. That's the way to do it several sources. The trouble is they're closing down any alternative sources, so they'll just end up with the one. 
Uh, so there we are. I think they're trying to get us all to become commies. Uh, Donald Weller, not another treasure box, you lovely, lovely, lovely man. But please, I don't want you to bankrupt yourself sending gifts to Scotty McClue on TikTok and all you beautiful YouTubers. Uh, last comment in this, there's also a prison doctor, police officers and detectives. What about, uh, would I make a good chief constable? And I can assure you that every single one of my officers has got your back. Because if for any reason they didn't have, I would take full responsibility as I have handpicked my officers. Thank you. What do you think with a big uniform on and all that stuff? Now, listening to opposing viewpoints from experts in a specific field, the truth will be in the middle. I think so, Big Hendo, but as you know, the first casualty of war is the truth. Can I direct you to the TikTok videos? Look for the ones where I'm wearing my Glen Gary, my red and white checkered hat. And you will hear me talking on a Remembrance Sunday to world leaders. And, uh, you know, that's why we shouldn't be having this. And I would like that to get out there. I mean, there's only a few hundred have seen it because that's what you get with videos nowadays. There's so much, there's so much media that you only get a few hundred, a few thousand looking at each individual video. I mean, having said that, I did a 10 second one and 36,000 had a look. You know, it's not bad. Uh, so there we are. So what about the prison doctor? Yes, I think you've had a stroke. We're going to keep you comfortable and see how things progress over the next few days. What age are you? 74, I see. <laughs> there we are. Uh, one of, uh, listening to the opposing viewpoints. Now, uh, 10 seconds in this generation attention span. Well, Big Hindo, I think that's right. I think a lot of the youngsters... They're so busy scrolling, they don't know how to settle down. But TikTok has got that because they can scroll past me and come back to me and think, no, no, this is the best. And I think that's what we're finding. I mean, we're well up to, I think we've got 20,000 followers, but millions have actually watched the TikTok videos, uh, especially the lives. They just don't all follow and they don't all subscribe on the YouTube channel. Scott Squad, definitely for you, Scotty. Bobby, is that the one with the chief? Uh, I love the chief. Not disparaging you, but you look a bit tired today. Love you, though. Think you do, James. You're never disparaging me. I probably am a bit tired. I tend to be a very, very busy man. But um, that's just the way life goes. You're never disparaging. There we are. Uh, a serotonin hit from scrolling. Could be big Hindu, not as much as you'd get from a banana. There we are. Uh, how much time per week do you set aside for watching television? Not very much nowadays, VG. I used to be a big television watcher because I worked for ITV. And we spent all day uh, not necessarily watching because there was a lot of work to be done behind the scenes, writing and um uh, you know, viewing promotions and fitting them in in presentation form, etc. But uh, in those days, we did all that, reading the news, getting the news right. But you could, in the evening, watch a good movie or something like that. I uh, love you, thanks. Busy's good. James, not at all. No problem at all. And you're never, ever disparaging. Very kind of you to even say. Uh, I'm, I'm surprised I look as well as I do. <laughs> Well documented. Watch the social dilemma. The algorithm is generated in a way to keep you scrolling. I see. Well, we need to get the algorithm to keep you stopping at Scotty McClure. Otherwise, they'll miss out on business. Donald Weller, what are you doing? Donald's sent me another treasure box. The third one. Or is it the fourth? Donald, you will be spending a fortune so they can get you to see more ads. 
I see, big handle. Well, what they'd be better doing is getting everybody with an internet connection to watch Scotty McClue and maybe get a top advertiser to pop a small ad in the middle just so we can all get a crust. How would that be? That would stop you scrolling. It's always good to hear some common sense. Stu Will, you're an absolute top man. You will be filled from the tip of your toes to the top of your head with common sense. So many people are, and yet they're not the ones controlling the media. Uh, if in actual fact, if you watch The Social Dilemma, you might better understand how to manipulate it. Ah, Biggs Hendo. Well, you get, tip me the wink. Here he is, Oliver Reed. Fantastic. There you go. I had a friend at a tea shop made. He used to drink in the same pub as Oliver Reed. And um, he had in the back, I drink with Oliver Reed. And one night he felt a pat on his back and he turned round and there was Ollie. And he said, would you like to make that true? He said, yeah, hi, amazing. And he said, right, I'll have, uh, he said, can I get you a drink? He said, yes, I'll have a vodka. And then he went over to the table, the silly boy, and he said, Ollie, was it a large vodka? And he said, darling, don't be a, I'll not say what he said, but you know what I mean? I think you'd be doing great in a Scottish history program. Yes. The algorithm to gain a bigger audience. Yes, we need a huge audience. Is there a YouTube algorithm? Because my YouTube channel gets massive compliments. It's just called Scotty McClure, the internet phone in. But it's only got something like 3,200 subscribers. You know, and I find that very strange. I loved it. I loved Ollie. So there we are. Love it. So there you are, Steve. That's a true story. Did you want a large vodka? Darling, don't be a... <laughs> Scotty, boy. And apparently you had a wonderful night with him. VJ Dukaram has just sent me three pounds. And it says it describes the meme. It says, lemon character raising both his thumbs up. VJ Dukaram, that is incredibly, incredibly kind of you. Incredibly kind of you. Thank you so much. VJ has tapped the dollar bill at the bottom of the YouTube live and sent me three great British pounds. What a lovely, lovely thing to do. Thank you, VJ. Do you think the monarchy should be abolished, Diane? How mad would that be? We've got rid of most of our assets in this country. Why would we get rid of the greatest asset we've got the monarchy brings in fortunes. Fact. The monarchy gives us credibility. Fact. The monarchy costs us the same as a bag of crisps. Fact. Right? The queen is an outstanding public servant. Fact. She is the curator and custodian of the crown. Fact. The monarchy is basically a Scottish institution. Fact, we took over the English crown in 1603, the union of the crowns. The crown is our symbol of authority. Fact, the monarchy has been about, the latest one for about 1,200 years. Before that, you can actually trace the monarchy back to before Scotland. You can trace it back 2,347 years to the ancestors of Re, the first royal. Fact, the old Celtic kings. So why on earth would anybody think the monarchy should be abolished? Bad press. There we are, politicians getting above themselves. We live, we live in a constitutional monarchy. It's perfect. Has Jamaica made a mistake? Oh, yes. But you can't tell people things. There we are. Uh, fantastic. Now, uh, wonderful stuff. Donny boy, I don't think that's the right amount. And the reason for that was so that there wasn't any upstaging of uh, his mother's 
Jubilee. So there we go. And plus remember that uh, he's not the monarch anyway. Karim has sent me lots of beautiful gifts. He sent me a TikTok. He sent April. He sent a wishing bottle. He sent a football. Karim, I've updated my wish list. I have. I don't seem to have got anything off the wish list yet, but tell me if you can see it. Uh, so there we go. VJ, thank you again. Very, very kind. Kareem, all these beautiful gifts. You're a top man. So you're traveling down the road, Kareem. You'll have to sit with the average speed cameras. I tend to just do about 50 odd now. It's not worth risking it. Uh, so there we are. I don't know much about that, Real Anonymous. What's your favorite single malt? Well, Stu, A, I wouldn't advertise whiskies on here, but I don't drink alcohol at all now. But I used to be an absolute expert on whiskey, malt whiskey. And I could tell you what they were. Fantastic. I don't see the wish list, Scotty. Aha. Can anybody see the wish list? Tell me if it works. There we are. We've just set up, guys. Uh, so I don't know what's going on. And I've got all these. I've got three beautiful treasure chests, it says here. So something must be working. I've got 2,400 likes. Uh, there we are. Got it. Seen it. Is it there, Kareem? What does it look like? Don't, for goodness sake, go to town on it now. Because I know what you're like for generosity. Guys, can you believe that we've only got eight minutes of this wonderful program left. How can that happen? Got it, seen it, yes. Fantastic. Uh, Kareem, stop, is sending me weights. Donald Weller has sent yet another treasure box. Donald, that's four treasure boxes. Stop, you'll bankrupt yourself. Kareem is sending me weights. He sent me 44 weights. Scotty, how are you? Kareem, that's amazing. Thank you. But I didn't want you to do that, my dear fellow. You're so generous and so kind. Uh, thanks for following, guys. We need everybody following Scotty McClure. Big style. Can somebody tell me how many followers we've got, please? Uh, hi, Scotty. How are you? Pinky. We're amazing. Lovely to have you with us. And Pinky, I really do admire and respect you for your candor. I think that's incredible. Well done, you, sir. That's a real top man. Uh, you've reached your wish list target. Have I, Kareem? There we are. I can't, I can't see you. What do you like? Big Hindo, you've got 20,300 followers. Excellent. Well, we need that up to 200,000. Yes, get that up there, I say. Get following every day. Uh, Donald, thank you very, very much. Donald has sent me all these beautiful gifts. Donald Weller. What a top man. Absolutely. Where, have, where are you from, Donald? Are you in the UK? Are you in America, the United States? Are you in Australia? Are you in India? Are you in Africa? We had a lovely gentleman on a journalist yesterday from Pakistan. And I thought that was just amazing. Uh, thank you and good night, Donald. I thank you. If you're saying thank you and good night, are you in Australia? That's what it's about. Lovely. And Donald, thank you for your kindness. It really, really is appreciated. That level of generosity, you've just surpassed uh, uh, everything. It's, it's just amazing. Uh, there we are. Thank you so much. So, Big Hindo, that's quite good if we're getting there. You know, it's not too bad for just a wee guy on TikTok. But it's Scotty McClure, so we need to be up to a couple of million followers. And then we'll be ticked off. It was my pleasure, Pinky, says. Pinky, my pleasure and privilege as well to know you. I think that's amazing. I can't believe I've only got five minutes left. Uh, thank you very much indeed. Very, very kind and very, very generous. Uh, as I say, if anybody is feeling flush, there is a GoFundMe.com forward slash Scotty hyphen McClure. And uh, if you've got a spare pound or uh, five pounds, you can put that in there because it all helps towards equipment. And we're well over halfway. We set a two and a half thousand pound limit. And I think there's about 1,300 pounds in already, you know, for equipment. It's great. And that's what got us on air in the first place. 
Yeah, we had to get new equipment. I tried everything. My fans will know the hours we sat with dodgy cameras and dodgy microphones on a very old laptop trying to get it to work to modern standards and just no dice. It was, oh, it's very shaky, Scotty. The sound's very poor. You're pixelating. So we had to invest in a whole new computer. Peace and love. Be fun loving. I have to nap now. Thanks, Scotty. James Housen. Have a lovely, lovely nap. And may the peace that passes all understanding go with you, my dear friend. Isn't that lovely? Uh, so there we have it. Uh, peace and love to every single one of you, I say. Uh, we are fun loving on here, are we not? I would say to you, we are actually fun loving. And that's what it's about. Tremendous. We opened up the phone lines. Martin phoned for a chat. So there we have it. And um, well, what have we got here? There's Archie has joined us. Dinky do. Bob has joined us. Welcome, Bob. Follow us, guys. As soon as you come on, I've uploaded so many TikTok videos. Uh, do you believe that Christ died for our sins? Uh, yes, I think he took he took away all the sins of the world. And he was the son of God. But I also believe that he has risen again and dwells among us in his risen power. So there you have it, you see. Uh, thank you for sending these beautiful red roses. Thank you, Bob. Very, very much appreciated. The generosity this morning has just been outstanding. I have never witnessed kindness like it. And I thank you so much. Uh, I'm just checking the time. I don't want to go over the time. Uh, we've got about another two minutes, I would say, and then we have to dash off. I hope you've enjoyed the live, guys. And I hope you enjoy the lives as much as I enjoy being with you. Because it's a lovely sort of unification of the world. It's a uniting of the children of the universe. You know, it's a sort of saying this is what life is about, not that. Yeah, this is what life's about. So feel free to follow Scotty McLean. Feel free to build our little community and enjoy the joy, bathe in the joy and the glory. That's what it's about, I say to you. There we are. You're watching Scotty McLean, first lord of the internet, hashtag float I, all in uppercase, F-L-O-T-I, and the world's top broadcaster, and the world's most humble man. Uh, that, I think, is very important so that people don't think I'm full of the blah. We don't want that, you know, full of the blah. Sometimes people say that sort of thing because they want to put you down. Uh, there you are. Particularly if you're a well-known public figure, they want to put you down. I see. Right, I'm going to say goodbye to our beautiful, beautiful TikTokers. Thank you for joining us. Sorry we didn't get round to the squeeze box, but Tempest Fugit, time flies when you're having fun, I always say. Bye-bye, uh, TikTokers. Have a gorgeous day on a lovely evening. Have a lovely sleep if you're down under. Take care of your dear selves. And dinky-doo, stick out your tongues and say ta-ta. Ta-ta.